Hello everyone, White Mage Serenia here, welcoming you back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. In our last episode, we landed next to this strange formation of trees here. And, they don't look suspicious at all. Also, I have a bit of an announcement before I actually begin. I have no further plans of doing my version of Let's Play Legends of Dragoon. I found another Let's Player who's currently working on that same project, named Bladed Lightning. So, I'm not going to do my version. However, Blade, I have been speaking to Bladed Lightning about this. Um, if uh, He's actually wa asked me to do a guest commentary on one of his videos, and I told him I would think about it. So, uh, Bladed Lightning, if you're watching this, I am actually currently considering doing your guest commentary work. I've been watching a few of your videos. It's pretty good so far, from what I can tell. So, alright guys, with that out of the way, let's begin by heading into the trees. Okay, this place doesn't look suspicious at all. It looks very familiar. Go inside. Hello, uh, Duncan! Yay! Ha <laughs> ha, why the surprised face? Did you think I had gone? Duncan, I'm so glad you're safe! Boing, 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 boing. Enough with the Mario. Whoa, Saban, this can't be tears! <laughs> Nothing happened to me. The earth yonder right open to take me, but I scrambled to safety. <laughs> well, I'm glad, old man. But wait, I thought Vargas killed you. Sabin! It is now time to complete your training. Use these new skills to ca smash Kefka. Put him up. Yo! Oh, hey, not nice. Ah, don't punch me, master. Owie! Uh, take this! Doesn't feel nice, does it, Master? Hey, take it easy, I said. Ouch! Why are you guys fighting on the roof, anyway? Don't come running to me if you damage your roof. Oh, whoa, hey, you're really gonna break your roof. Stop that! Boom, boom. Boom, uh, okay. I guess they suddenly went Super Saiyan on me. Oh, you broke your roof. I'm not paying for that. <laughs> it's your own fault. I call this the Bum Rush. Okay, um, honestly, from what I understand, the bum rush is the mistranslation of that move. It's actually called Phantom Rush, but truth be told, I prefer bum rush, to be honest, totally honest with you, because it just seems to fit the move a little bit more. The drawback to it is, is it, it cannot choose its target, so it's random. However, if you have multiple targets, it's usually better to, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? To use Airblade anyways. Okay, now, you know, here's something I found funny. It's supposed to give you every one of his blitzes that he w didn't master up to now, but for some odd reason it didn't give me Spiraler. But that's okay. Spiraler's largely useless anyway. What Spiraler does is it ejects Sabin from the battle in order to heal every one of your party members back to full. However, since it does eject him from the battle, it's almost counterproductive to do that. However, it does have you. It can be useful in a tight spot, but I don't. I don't care for it much. I would much rather use mantra, anyways. All right, guys, let's go. All right, here we have a new enemy, the Reach Frog, all lined up in a row for us. There, Setzer, I want you to do slots. Sabin, I want you to do Air Blade, just to wipe these guys out. Edgar, you attack. And Celeste, you use Ice 2 on all. Air Blade! Bow, 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 bow. <laughs> Ooh, it didn't kill them all. That, that, that's a first. Oh well, Ice 2 sure should. Alrighty then, now to get back to the main scope of this one, this video. Alrighty then, now there's another problem we need to take care of. A menace of disguise named Doomgaze. Now, the way this guy works is while you're in the airship, he appears at a fixed location on the map. Now, before I actually did this video, what I did was I took the liberty to find him and then reload my game. So, let's go. Also, here's another thing. Doomgaze, as soon as he starts, casts L5 Doom, which 
kills anyone that has a level of level five and a multiple of level five. So any level ending with zero or five. Also, every t he has a chance to run from the battle, but uh, don't worry too much about that because he keeps his HP as it was when you first last fought him. So he does not heal at all. So if you keep at it, you'll eventually take him down. All right, come over here, and this is where he spawn where I found him at. Over near Zen there. Doom Gaze. L5 Doom. Alright, Saban, time to demonstrate the amazing power that is Bum Rush. Alright, I want you to do drill, Saban. Alright, Setzer, you don't have anything worth mentioning. Ooh, oh, crap, almost got H-Bomb. Really wish I could have got that. Alright, Celeste, you're my designated healer for this. Saban... You know what to do, yet again. Go for it. The Bum Rush. Now, uh, Death Doom Gaze here can also cast Doom, which, uh, ooh, three bars. I've never got that, so let's see what that does. Yeah, Arrow's pretty powerful. It takes, like, a certain percentage of your HP or something. I don't know. But it's pretty powerful, yeah. Bum Rush! I kind of hope that doesn't... Okay, good. It didn't kill it. Now I get to see what three uh, bars do. I've never seen that before. Lifeguard. Oh, okay, yeah, I have. The three bars randomly summons an Esper. But that's cool. Now everyone has region. That's something that we needed there for sure. All right, Edgar, you assist on the healing there. Bum rush. Bam, 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 bam. All right. Boom. Every time. Constant 999. Oh, yes. Saban. That's why I like you, man. <laughs> Plus, it's so fun doing that 360 motion, too. Come on. One more time, Saban. I get the feeling he's almost gone. One more bum rush for me, please. Uh-oh. If bum rush doesn't kill him, H-bomb surely will. Boom. Okay, also, despite its appearance, bum rush is actually magical. It looks physical, but it's not. It's magical base. Saban, keep it up with Bum Rush. He's almost gone. I can feel it. Wow, that didn't do anything to him. That is not good. Uh oh. Hope everyone survives that. Oh boy, this isn't looking good. Oh yeah. Come on, one more Bum Rush ought to do it. Also, Doom Gaze can sometimes cast Ice 3 on everyone, so you want to be careful. Oops, Ice healed it. <laughs> Whoopsie. Alright, come on, Saban. Come on! Uh-oh. That's no good. Alright, help with healing there, Edgar. Saban, you keep on bum rush. Don't worry about reviving uh, Setzer. We ain't got time. Come on, Saban. Come on! We can do this, Saban. Oh, yes. Alright! We got him. Whew! See? The bum rush is just amazing when there's only one enemy on the screen. Oh, yeah. Whew. That was tougher than I remember. But it's well worth it. Because now we get the Esper Bahamut. Yay, Bahamut. Alright, guys. Also, here's something you really should know about Doomgaze. If you use the Vanish Doom trick on Doomgaze to kill him in one blow, you do not get Bahamut. So keep in mind, do not use Vanish Doom. Do not use it on him. Uh, you GBA players of Final Fantasy VI are lucky, because the Vanish Doom trick is non-existent in the, uh, place or the GBA version of the game. Alrighty then, guys. Uh, this is actually all the time that I have for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. In the uh, next time, or in the next episode, we're going to head into Mount Zozo. So, let's head on over to Zozo, and we'll make, we'll wait there. Alright, there's Miranda. Okay, so that would mean Zozo would be right... Yes, right here. Alright, guys, this is White Mage Serenia signing off of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. Join us next time when we head into Mount Zozo and try to find out what's going on up there. Have a nice day, everyone, and thank you so much for watching.
Have a nice day.